Oh my god, it smells like coffee in here. I absolutely love the font they use for any energy. Ooh, whoa. So freaking cool. Oh my god. <gasps> whoa. Holy crap. That's good. What? Ew, it's so bad. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel. Let me tell you today's video. You guys, I am so excited. Today's video, we're gonna be testing YouTubers' products. I feel like there's such a difference from YouTubers' merch and their products. I'd rather buy something that I can actually use like every single day. I don't know if you can see, but I actually bought five different YouTubers' products. One is digital and one, let me tell you, I had so many problems with it. It's gonna be in the video just later in the video, but as of right now, Friday the 22nd, it's still not freaking here. So make sure to like this video, subscribe down below, and click the notification bell. And if you're not subscribed to my vlog channel, what are you doing? That will be linked down below because I upload two to three vlogs a week. Without further ado, let's just get to testing these YouTubers' products. Okay, first one is from Chamberlain Coffee. Okay, first YouTuber we're gonna be doing is Emma Chamberlain. She actually has a lot of products and I was debating which one I wanted to get. She has a planner, um, a coffee company, and something else. I can't remember what it was. It's in her intro, like I have a planner, coffee company, and something else, but I can't remember what it is. And I feel like I connected more to the coffee than a planner. Like, we got a good amount of planners. Now I was really debating on which one to get. Like, my first impression should be good. So for the price, it's $20 for 10 bags. And if you, like, put in your phone number or something, you actually could get 10% off. I'm not sure how long that's going on. This was honestly one of the only products that I actually had to pay shipping. The shipping was $5, so the total was $23. First, oh my god, it smells like coffee in here. So when you open the box, this is what's on the top. And then on the back, she has a signature and a little note. And then here is the actual coffee. I think I got the wrong one. Oh no, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. <laughs> so here's how the packaging looks. And here's the actual tea bag. This smells really strong, but it smells really freaking good. It definitely does not smell like tea. This is coffee right here. Basically what you do is you put this in water and then you put it in the fridge and it cold brews. So let's go do that. Oh shoot, I did it wrong. What I'm gonna do is just leave the bag inside. Now, where do I put it so my family doesn't ruin it? I think I'm gonna put it in the back. There it goes. See you tomorrow. Okay, so the actual consistency is actually pretty liquidy. It's not really thick at all. It just tastes like the one we have at home. It doesn't taste any different. Oh. It tastes exactly the same. That's good. Actually, it tastes a little different. Uh, I think about it. That's good. What? What do you give her coffee? I give it out of five quarts. I would give it a five. I like it. Five? I'm going to give it a four out of five because it does taste like everything else, but I think it's because of the creamer. So that's why I give it four out of five. Okay, next one. This one I'm actually really excited about. It is um, pitch black outside, so I can't do this today. Oh my god, the packaging is so freaking nice. So the next one we're gonna be doing is Lord DIY, and she came out with a tie-dye kit, so I decided to get that. So the tie-dye kit is $20, and shipping is $6.66, which is, ah, and oh, I actually paid tax on this. $1.45 for tax, and the total I paid was $28.10. Now, compared to Amazon, I think I spent more on Amazon. Never mind. Oh my god. 
is so freaking nice. So this is how the packaging looks, and as you can tell, you can actually tie-dye up to 30 projects. The last tie-dye challenge I did with my sister was a little of a disaster. I think I know how to do it this time, okay? So it comes with five different colors. The colors are yellow, lime, turquoise, fuchsia, and coral. And on the back, it shows you how to do it. So in the package, it comes with the bottles, and then, what is this? It comes with some kind of powder. Then it comes with some rubber bands, and these are actually a lot stronger than the Amazon ones. What the heck? Packaging, 10 out of 10. The packaging and design on this is literally so freaking cool. Like, look at the graphic design on like showing you different patterns. Without further ado, let's go test this. I think I'm gonna go for like a blue. Okay, we have our water here. Perfect. Now, last time I got it all over myself. So, oh my god, Roxanne came. What is up, baby girl? Okay, out, Roxy. You want me to tie dye you? <laughs> okay, out. Why this time you want to be with me? to wait six to eight hours and then rinse it out updates the next day wash this out okay ready three two one Crap. It's looking wet, so I'm just gonna leave it here to dry, but this is how it looks. Kinda did my own pattern. I didn't do one of the ones that was on the box, so if you probably actually try, then it will look better. <laughs> I just like scrunched it and then put dye around it. So yeah, that's how it looks. Okay, for the rating, I'd say overall is a five out of five. I think if I really tried more, it'd probably look better. Um, like did one of the designs in the box, but I just did whatever I felt like, so that's why it looks like this. I think it still looks cool, but I didn't do one of the ones on the box, so this is honestly my favorite one. I tried the whole video. Okay, next one. I'm actually really freaking excited about this. I don't know how it's gonna taste. Wrapping, very good and secure. The next YouTubers we're gonna be doing is Josh and Bryce's energy drink, AKA Annie Energy, if I can take it out. It's kind of heavy low key. Zach can handle caffeine, but an energy drink, this is actually the first time I'm trying an energy drink. So this is how the bottle looks. I absolutely love the font they used for Annie Energy. Vegan, gluten-free, and 30 calories per can. And I got it in black cherry. I was very hesitant on getting this, not only because of the flavor. Like I didn't want 12 of them, so I paid 24 for this and the first one this is actually free shipping and there's also no tax so I just paid a flat $24 ow ready cheers Woo! ooh whoa honestly it doesn't taste like caffeine and the fact that there is caffeine I think it's just smarter to just drink a sprite if there's like a cherry sprite or something that's what this tastes like I don't know if there is because I don't really drink soda we're gonna do it one more time we have to throw this out Zach it doesn't taste that good Oh my god, the aftertaste. Ah, this is really bad aftertaste. Yikes. Okay, three, two, one. Woohoo! It's not that good. Stop drinking it. Blech. Out of five Roxy's, I'd give it a two because honestly, you can get this anywhere. But like the packaging, like I want to like it because the packaging is so freaking dope. It's like this blue and purple ombre kind of vibe. I took a hole, put it all out, and I filled it with water. Yeah, so. she's not drinking the full thing. It's really bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, tie me, tie me. I feel like the other flavor tastes better because it's like, like, tastes more like Sprite. Yeah. But I was like shocked because I thought, I, I was shocked. No, like in a good way. Like I, I was, knew like, it would be shit. I knew it was like, like, should you know how many times I say like? Yeah. Okay. I knew it was going to be like soda vibes, but I was like yeah. shocked that it tastes like good sort of i don't know i don't know what i'm saying you but know. i'm surprised that it, they added like this coffee into like the soda vibe yeah out of five four i'd give it like a two one yeah, one same. no two i was surprised 
Okay, next one up is actually a digital product, so I'll show you the email. The next YouTuber is Aspen Ovard. First, before we go into this, if you don't know who this is, let me just like show you a little of her Instagram. Like, oh my god, so aesthetic. So she has like these preset packs. Basically, a preset is just like you put it over your photo and then it makes it look like aesthetically pleasing. So I bought the least expensive one because I wasn't about to spend a hundred dollars on a freaking preset. So the one I got was thirty dollars still, mm, but I wanted to test it out for you guys so we we can both see how it is. So I think they sent me an email a long time ago. Here it is. View content. So this is what you get inside of it. You get a tutorial of how to use it, which is honestly really helpful. And then it comes with three different ones. Just to make sure I do this right, I've done this a couple times. So I'm able to explain it to you. This is how the file looks. It's not actual gray photos. You'll see what it does a little bit. So it comes with the tutorial. So I'm going to show you guys how I use my presets. So you're going to airdrop them to Lightroom and import the files and even if the file is showing up as a gray square that is okay and it should pull up as a photo so you can just go on and click on the photo and then you click create preset by selecting the dots in at the top right corner. Pretty simple. This is what you're going to do. You're going to go to Lightroom which is also free to download on a phone but you have to have the actual Adobe subscription for the computer. So the gray photo should actually show up like this. So this is the first one, this is the second one, and then this is the third one. And how you save them is you just click the three dots and create preset and you can just like name it whatever so like I love Roxy and Rosie or something like that but to make it easy I think I'm just gonna do Aspen Ovard one two and then three. Oh, it doesn't show me the before and after oh it does wow before after before wow that one really looks different before after before <laughs> After, wow. Okay, so now we're gonna pick a couple sample photos to see how this looks. Okay, first up, we're gonna do this one. As you can see, it's very dark, very gray, and then all you have to do is click the presets one, and then boom. Ah, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, there we go, that's a little better. There we go. Ooh, I like that. I don't know what it does, but I feel like it like crisped it more. Like I feel like it's more clear. I don't know what it does. I think this is the one we're gonna do. Presets. See, it's a little too white. That one is good. That one's good. That one's good. And then I'm just gonna put the temperature up. Before, after, before, after. Look how like ew, like this blue color is like. Honestly, I think this is worth it. I think it is. But like things like this was like really bad. Like as you can see, the overall colors are like really like weird, like a dark blue kind of vibe. Like come on, that looks really good. Also, look before. I feel like it like made her even more crisp, you know what I mean? So overall, I'd say this is a three out of five because I don't know, I feel like if you're just getting it for like this, like yeah, it looks really good, but I don't know if I'd pay that much money. Like I think $10 is reasonable. Now something I left for last, I think we're gonna test on this one. I don't know if you guys saw my vlog channel, but I posted like a how to make Aspen Ovard presets for free. And I still have the actual preset, so let's see how that looks. I think it was this one. This is hers, this is mine. Something I can see from mine is it's a lot more gray. Like the blanket looks like a whole nother freaking color. Blue, purple. <laughs> we'll try increasing the temperature. See, I feel like when you increase the temperature here, it's more of a yellow, you know what I mean? My thing that I created is honestly like pretty similar. Up to you, if you wanna get it, you should, but I just thought it was worth it, so that's why I got it, so yeah. You freaking guys, look what decided to come. This one took a little bit, a little bit. Also, sorry about lighting. I have my big ring light out, but like the sun's doing its thing where it goes like, Ch -ch -ch -ch, so don't mind that. The next person, I was honestly skeptical if it was even gonna come in the mail in general. I wanna say all the other ones came in two or three days, but this one literally took two weeks. So if you're thinking of buying this, um, it, it takes a while. I don't know if that's just where I live, but it takes a while. I don't really follow the Dolan twins, but I was on YouTube last week and I noticed that there is a video that was like We're quitting YouTube or something. So we're gonna do them in spirit because I really wanted to try this one out So the actual candles $36 and this is what I think is a little stupid. I'm already paying what? $36 for a candle. What is that at Target like five or six dollars? So if you want it to not arrive cracked you have to pay the route package protection, which is 98 cents Which why would you not pay that? So I just paid it. Why not? There's a discount Discount code just like Emma, so I saved three dollars and sixty-nine cents, and they actually charge for shipping, which was seven dollars. So the total was forty-three dollars and thirty-six cents. Let's see if I even like this. <laughs> 
Ooh, packaging is really freaking nice. Oh my god, you can literally smell the fragrance from the box. Oh my god. So just for reference, I got the candle called Relax. There's five different ones. I'll put them on the screen. So on the box, it just says Wake Heart Crystal Candles. And the description for this one is lavender, chamomile, and apple blossoms. Okay. Each of our scented candles contains a unique crystal. Each of our scented candles contains a unique crystal whose energy helps to promote healing. Oh my god. Oh my god. This smells so freaking good. So this is how it looks. Obviously, if you get this candle, you should most likely get the protection because this coming in cracked, I think that would literally make me cry. Without further ado, let's go light this baby. Absolutely beautiful. Just get a match. Ha 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 ha. We're gonna keep it right there because this is like my productive area. So we need to relax right here. <laughs> And boom! Update, we're currently at Walmart trying to find her ice cream. I really hope it's at this one. Please, please, please. No, I don't see it. Jojo, where are you? Nowhere. Update, they didn't have it there. So now we're gonna be going to another Walmart and seeing if they have it. We're at another Walmart and we're really hoping they have it because you drove far. I swear they don't have it. Look. Who's here? There's more than one. Oh my god. No. A lot more than one. Oh my god. Okay. We're trying the ice cream. Jo, Jo, <laughs> Jo, Jo. Three Walmarts. The front looks a little scary because the flavor is sugar cookie. She's so cute. Flavor ice cream with purple and blue frosting swirls and rainbow candles. This is how it looks. Ooh. Perfect Ready? for a birthday party. Oh, Three, two, one. Ew, it's so bad. No, don't say that about Jojo. Let me try it's it. So I kind of like it. Probably creamy. It tastes like a uh, birthday cake. Mm. It's actually really good. It's really sweet. A kid's birthday party it's would love this. Evelyn, when you were in elementary, you would have loved this. Yeah. I could have saved so much money buying this Jojo it's ice cream. kind of good. Without all the candy. I don't know. It's not bad. It does say artificial flavors. All right. <laughs> but it's it's not bad. Flavors. Hey. Editing Zach here. I swear I filmed an outro. It just vanished from my computer. If I were to recommend one thing from today's video, I'm gonna say the tie-dye kit because I feel like I got a lot of food. <laughs> Honestly, I'm tied between the tie-dye kit and the candle. I think the candle is really good for relaxing. It's a good like self-gift, but if you wanna do something with your friends, it's just a fun activity to do with your friends. So honestly, I'm gonna say the tie-dye. So make sure to like this video, subscribe down below with notifications because um, I don't know if you guys saw, but this past week I went live like two or three times and you wouldn't know if you didn't click the notification so that's why you click notification so if you want to catch me on my next live i'm thinking like once a week or every other week because i don't want to get it too obsessive um then make sure to click the notification so you don't miss out on my lives and you can be the first one to watch my videos when they go up i'll link all the youtubers products down below so it's nice and easy for you to get them and i really hope you enjoyed this video thank you so very much for watching if you watch all the way to the end and i will see you next week with a new video yo okay bye <laughs> oh, oh, oh.